I saw Becker, Edberg, Sampras, all having been there before. Then I'd made it into juniors and I really started to dream big and hoped one day to be also there. bigger breakthrough was maybe when I uh, qualified for my first um, ATP tournament in Toulouse back in the day in 98 and then got the wild card into Basel and played against Andre Agassi uh, which was an unbelievable dream come true for me. That was for me the breakthrough year. People around me remind me what my uh, checkpoints are, my dates are. It's a great support system I have going right now. Everybody knows their role on my team and that's very important and they would do anything for me which is uh, very sweet of them. I appreciate that and I tell them that every day. It's that great deep feeling you have inside of yourself that you're just very proud and you feel like all the hard work has all come and paid off. I felt like, wow, I've made it. I'm world number one the next week on the, on the computer rankings and it was a very special moment in my life. It was a big surprise if I look back uh, when I was eight years old, 12 years old, 14, I never really thought I was going to be there. It was more of a, a joke like, oh my God, I'm going to win Wimbledon and become world number one. And that I was able to do it. I'm still very proud to this day that I became world number one that day. In 2014, honestly, I'm very positive about it. I think it's going to be a very good season for me. I feel like I can attack again in 14, and that's kind of what the mindset is right now.